Hey guys, so we're at a home center in a sort of a rural part of Japan and these are all deterrents to deter crows. So lots of shiny things you can see here. That's a sort of a blow up balloon type thing. Oh, that's strings you string across, put the birds off, crows and pigeons and anything else that wants to eat your crops. Oh yeah. So it's sort of reflections and shiny things. So there's a thing that looks like an owl with reflective eyes. Just basically a CD that you dangle up by a string. Looks like a big eye or something. <laughs> a big rubber bird. <laughs> we actually see all these things too out in the fields. And a big predatory looking bird. So we do actually see these things out hanging on things out in the field. Oh yeah, some electronic thing that makes some noise. We showed you one once before that actually makes an explosion every 15 minutes or something to scare them away. They use that at the airport too. Uh, an inflatable scarecrow. <laughs> yeah. We see those. We do see those out there. They put their own clothes, Oji san's clothes and hat on them. And then if all that doesn't work, that's a cap gun. So just go out there and bang, bang, scare the birds away <laughs> for $8. Or this one, this is a sort of last resort, isn't it? Really good looking slingshot with, with little glass balls. That looks like a bit of a weapon, doesn't it? Go out and really give the crows some <laughs> little refill balls there if you've used up all your bag of balls. Four dollars for a bag of refill balls. That looks like a pretty good slingshot, doesn't it? A person would be tempted to buy that and try it out. Oh, just nets, just nets to hang over your over your trees. So yeah, semi rural part of Japan, that's the sort of thing we see next to the bags that you use to bag your rice. Anyway, there was that. More videos coming soon.